So here with me, I have on my shoulders my backpack and it's not less than 10 kilos, it's not less than 9 kilos, not 8 kilos, but 7 kilos. I packed everything I need for my new trip in Egypt in less than 7 kilos. So let's start, I'll show you my luggage, everything inside of the luggage, all the items I bring with me. Let's go and let's dip into uh, this new video about traveling and packing light. Let's go! Everything in my bag is there and I decided to show you every single item for you to know what I pack for my next trip. So we'll start with MacBook M1 here. So this computer, I have it for one year and it's really, really a great computer. Not the most expensive, but really powerful for my videos and everything. And I bring it with me everywhere. It's kind of light. It's 1.4 kilos and I put it inside of this protection where I installed inside behind here an air tag in case of I'm losing my computer, I can uh, find it. So it's very uh, convenient to have this uh, air tag inside and it's a protection if someone tried to steal my computer I can track it so that's my MacBook and then after to charge my MacBook and all my items I have this uh, charger with a GAN charger so it's kind of like uh, super efficient super light you see the size is very like very small I have installed on it two cables to plug all of my device so I have one charger for all of my uh, equipment. This is a Peak Design small um, bag, a sling, 3 liter, that I use to put my equipment during the day. For example, if I go for uh, visiting the day, I can put inside my two cameras. Inside of it, I also hide some air tag to track if I lose it. Then after we go a little down and there is this um, portable hard drive that I designed myself. I buy the, um, uh, the case with like USB-C. So the cable is included here, as you can see. And uh, it's a very convenient one because it's quite waterproof. And then inside I installed a SSD uh, two terabytes. So it's good for saving all my files in case I lose uh, or I crash my computer. So very, very, very uh, useful. And you cannot really like uh, do without this one. Then here it's, Insta360 Go 2. I review this in my uh, channel in French. I use it if I want to film people, people when they don't see me filming. And I will use it also uh, in my next trip to go uh, underwater. Then after I have this small uh, plastic case where I put my uh, business card. On this next trip, I decided to use this camera that I used at the beginning of my channel, Sony uh, FDR X3000 plus the Sony ZV-1 that you cannot see and I'm recording the video with. And after a simple power bank, random power bank, but quite portable, quite small with a lightning cable there. Those are like basic AirPods uh, 2 here. Then after we have the pocket with kind of like all the cable. I don't really have a lot, but I need cable to plug my uh, two cameras and microphone. So that's a small pocket from Muji. Then after there is my um, phone here iPhone 11, it's still in good condition for two years of use. Then here is sunglasses. I made my sunglasses here in Turkey. Then there is my passport that I used for many years and you can almost not read French. Then I have this small wallet where I have like two credit cards inside. It's um, MagSafe, so I can put it directly behind uh, my phone. And I use it sometimes like this, but most of the time, I use it in my pocket and I don't do that. There it's a very small uh, water bottle that I buy here in Turkey, but you find it all around the world and it's 250 milliliter. It's not too much, but believe me, it's super cool because this water bottle uh, is also a thermos. So 12 hours of hot and it's 24 hours of cold. You can go for bigger one, but bigger one means uh, more uh, heavy and I don't want uh, to go uh, more than seven kilos. So I use this one. I really, really love it because when I go for a day, like in my bag, small bag, three liter, I can put this one inside with my cameras and all my equipment. So very good uh, water bottle, thermos. Then here it's a down jacket. You probably know that it's very light and portable. And when it's uh, cold, you need one. So I always bring that with me. 
Um, then here it's my watch uh, pouch from Muji and I've been like very, very minimalist on it. Here is my air gel. I put my air gel in this kind of like small box from Muji again and it's very like convenient because it saves me like uh, space in my luggage. Muji again and again and again and it's my toothpaste here. So it's a simple product, but at least you know that's what's good about Muji. When I push on it, it's not going away, it's not like uh, leaking in your luggage and that's what's good about Muji. A little more expensive, but really, really like a good product. All those products go inside of this uh, watch pouch that you can fold after like this and then after like this. And then when it's closed, it's very, very thin and that's the minimum I can do. Believe me, I tried many other solutions and it's never really like working well. So this is the best size of washing pouch I can do. And extra I buy because I love perfume because I'm French and I buy this perfume. Then here I have something named Nano Bag. I use it for many years and sometimes when my luggage is a little more full than usual with food and other products, I uh, unfold that and I use it um, to carry more stuff with me. And then last but not least, I will start first with what I'm wearing now because this is part of what I'm gonna bring with me and it's a pair of jeans. That's the base for me, a pair of jeans and I have a white t-shirt but more than that, I'll bring with me four t-shirts. It's one more than what I was planning but I'll explain to you, I have this stripe white t-shirt it's made of cotton and i really love it it's uh cos this one is h&m and it's made of linen because i'm going in a hot country and i want something a little more blue with my jeans blah 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 then here it's a black t-shirt from cos again it's cotton and this is a dalida t-shirt because dalida used to be a very famous french singer and under that there is like two pair of socks and um two underwear everything here will go inside of my backpack so let's take here everything and and backpack for the backpack i decided to go for the brand north face very good brand i know for many years and the model is the Boer alice so i'm not going to explain everything about this uh this bag but a few um details are that are quite cool is for example here you can put uh, for example, your down jacket in front, that's cool. Then you can also like attach uh, your down jacket here. There is some kind of like uh, strap, I think that's a word in English. And so you can have something going inside here. What's good about it here, it's you have a compartment here. Uh, first of all, to put your computer. So that's quite cool because your computer is protected against uh, scratch and everything and then there is another one so that's the main compartment here and then after there is this front one where you can uh, put a lot of stuff like for example I didn't mention but I have a pen here and you have a lot of space for all your uh, gears and that's really cool because everything is well like separated inside of your bag and that's what I like about it and then extra pouch here where you can put your sunglasses here and it's made of a a mesh that is kind of like very soft and will not scratch your uh, glasses. So that's the Borealis bag that I will bring with me on this trip. I paid quite expensive here in Turkey. I think in, in the US it's $50 and I paid like 90 euros, almost $100 here. Well, and let's carry this beautiful baby. How many kilos a baby? Up. Let's see. It's six. 630 kilos so that's the total uh 640 kilos total uh weight of this bag here for three weeks to one month in egypt backpack ready next aventure will be egypt so if you're new on the channel consider to subscribe and i'm gonna bring all around the country but i'll explain that in the next video so don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you're new and you want to know more about egypt and let's see you in a new adventure around the world ciao bye